Hello, friends. This is Pascal calling in from Base Camp, calling Friday, October 28th. Um, we had a really awesome rest day here. Uh, did the usual Base Camp rest day type of activities, some laundry, airing out the sleeping bags, trying to burn out some of the bed gloves we picked up along the way, <laughs> you know, that kind of stuff. Anyhow, uh, we've decided we're going to do our attempt at the summit tomorrow. Well, I started to climb, so we're um, going to wake up at 4 a.m., go to our high camp have a short little nap, and then do a midnight or 1 a.m. alpine start for the summit. Um, we don't know what to expect. Uh, we've run into a lot of wind crests hitting on some really sugar snow. Looks like it might get worse at the top. It's quite windy and cold and on the summit. So, um, we'll see Hey there. This post is for you gearheads out there, or just anyone who wants to have a little glimpse of what Climbing life is all about. Um, when we left the monastery for base camp, we all left our trekking stuff behind, changed into our climbing pants, uh, and we were really excited once we got here to finally switch out of our trekking boots uh, into our climbing boots. So Lonnie and I have been using some Garmont Tower uh, three-season mountain boots for the trek, which have been outstanding. And we've now switched to our Garmont Pumarees, which are basically a one-and-a-half Boot, so it's got an inside liner that's sewn to the outside. They're super light, and they were great on our approach to high camp. Uh, aside from that, we're all using about two ice tools, or an ice tool and a mountain air next. And that's what we're using to get up the mountain with our crampons. As for tents, we're staying in the Hildeberg Namaji 3 tent. Um, the three of us are in there. And basically comes in at a nice light five pounds. But still gives us plenty of room for the three of us to remain friends throughout this climb. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, some of us are sleeping on some Z-Rest foam pads, and some of us are some nice, luxurious X-Bed winter down mats, which are going to be really nice once we're up on the ice. 